the timber industry in Sarawak has mastered the technology of manufacturing MDF using fiber extracted from wood residues of mixed tropical hardwood like timber slab, offcuts, pillar core and log and trimmings. MDF is a panel product manufactured by gluing together wood fiber using synthetic adhesive. This presentation briefly highlights the process of manufacturing MDF in Sarawak. Wood chipping The process starts with wood chipping. Wood residues which have been sorted out according to density classes will be transported to the wood chip mill for chipping into uniform sizes. The uniform size chips are transported by trucks to the wood chip yard for storage. Chip washing Wood chips are washed with clean water to remove contamination such as dirt and sand. After that, they go through a magnet machine to remove metal and iron scraps. This is an important step as clean wood chips can reduce tool wear, maintenance costs and operation downtime. Defibrator the wood chips undergo a pre-steaming process inside the preheater to soften the chips and squeeze resins out of the chips. This process prevents sporting defects to be formed on the finished board. The cooked chips then go through the defibrator where they are turned into uniform fibers. The fibers are then mixed with adhesive in the next process. Adhesive Adhesive is used as a bonding material to stick the fibers strongly together. Synthetic adhesive is commonly used to produce high-quality MDF with good dimensional stability, water resistance and mechanical strength. MDF produced in Surawa complies with the Japanese Industrial Standards GIS requirement for low emission of formaldehyde. Fiber drying Fiber drying is technically a process of removing moisture in fibers through a special tube dryer that uses hot gases generated from the energy plant. Dried fibers are stored temporarily in storage bins for unspecified periods of time as stockpile. This method ensures that there is always sufficient supply of fibers flowing onto the mat forming process. Mat forming Dried fibers from the storage bin are spread at a consistent rate to form a continuous fiber mat. The ability to form a fiber mat with equivalent density and mat height is especially important to ensure consistency for the continuous hot press. Pre-compression An effective pre-compressor ensures that the continuous hot press will receive a mat in good form. Its main function is to release air trapped inside the fiber mat in order to create a good and even surface before the continuous hot press. Hot Pressing The production of MDF utilizes continuous press technology. Here, the hydraulic and computerized press control systems are used to facilitate the customizing of the density profile and board properties. The continuous hot press compresses the mat under high temperature and pressure to convert it into raw boards with required board thickness. Cooling After emerging from the continuous hot press, the raw boards are cross-cut to specific uniform lengths. They are then placed in the cooling wheel before being stacked for conditioning purposes. Finishing Finally, the board is sanded to create a fine surface finish while maintaining consistent thickness tolerance. Every piece undergoes stringent quality checks throughout the entire production process from raw material usage up to finished boards. All these are done to ensure only consistently high-quality MDF panels are produced, packed and delivered to customers at all times. MDF are used as material for flooring, decking, wall panels and furniture. 
The MDF industry in Sarawak has now proven its ability to convert wood residues into high-value products true to the slogan that nothing should go to waste.